This is the new art mural that artists are bringing to life in the Hilltop area. They are hoping that this artwork can lift up the community that for two years now has had to give up the Summer Jam West concert just because of this pandemic. NBC 4's Kenny Ramirez joining us now live in the Hilltop explaining what the artists hope this community is going to take from this mural. Kenya. Brad and Darlene, well, the mural isn't ready quite yet, but the goal of the artist is to get people talking, get people inspired, and make sure they do good things together. Kind of want to do the whole thing in this, like, here's the thing about art. Coral color now. Sometimes it starts off as something small. Other times it's, well, like this. Big, loud, and open for interpretation. In the Hilltop area, Danny so Peterson says uh, the community really needs this. The Hilltop has, has long been an art desert. I like that sky. That sky turned out real nice. Each year they make murals Yay. and are asked to meet certain requirements. When they proposed this contest for um, this year's mural, it was, you know, how can you create a, a design that involves, you know, some of the icons from Summer Jam, including the jelly jar and the butterfly. But this year's theme, pursuing good together, hit differently. Public art is a really powerful tool to bring people and communities together. And so when people see this kind of investment, they're much more likely to want to take ownership and pride in their neighborhood. It's why they decided to do it at the Third Way Cafe. We kind of realized that like, Simply coming together over a cup of coffee to talk about ideas is a really great way for people to come together. While also leaving the artwork open for interpretation. Just coming together, people who look and come from different places, kind of sitting and eating together. That's kind of stuck in my head since it came out. Like. And the artists hope to be done by Thursday or Friday. And by the looks of it, they might be done on Thursday. It's too soon to tell. But of course, anyone is welcome to come check it out in person at the cafe. Live and local for you, Kenny Ramirez, NBC4. Uh